what's up y'all it's me sydney and i'm back with another video so in today's video i will be going over the it girl aesthetics yes what is the it girl aesthetics you may ask it is basically a guide that i have created to help you with healthiness fitness wellness create that content that you would like just overall becoming that new it girl so maybe you want to get fit maybe you want to get thick i don't know but the it girl aesthetics has you covered make sure to comment like and subscribe for more videos from me and thank you to all my new subbies how you doing <laughs> yeah i'm so happy to be here so without further ado let's get into this workout when i begin my workout i always like to get on the treadmill and walk it out because who wants to work out and you haven't warmed up yet so put that treadmill on an incline of six and walk at a speed of 3.0 I haven't got to that level where I'm running yet, but it's getting there. So over um, to the racks, I start off with some hip thrusts. And don't worry, I'm only doing tens because I haven't got there yet, like I said. But <laughs> tens are just fine. We can start off. The bar is 45 pounds. So we got 45 plus 10 plus another 10 this ain't no math quiz, but you see what it is. You see what your girl over here lifting. You feel me? So I decided to do three sets of 12. And I do want to incorporate that when you are doing these hip thrusts, keep your knees and your feet at like a 90 degree angle. That way um, you can fully commit to the thrust. I didn't put the clips on the ends of the weight. So when you are doing hip thrust, you do want to add the clips just so that you can do a good thrust without your plates falling off. If you do decide you want to do more than 10s, 25s, or 45s. But I do recommend taking your time. I only did three sets of 10. And like I said, if you're making this face, yeah, you're doing it right. I must say, drink your water. Stay hydrated, please. If you do anything, stay hydrated. And if you can't drink water, just drink it during the workouts. That's all. So now I'm going in with the 10 pound plates and I'm doing individual weighted sit ups. And after my individual weighted sit ups, I'm going in with the Russian twist. This exercise right here, I have like, I don't know if I'm always looking bloated or whatever may be the case, but this brush and twist targets the area like around my belly button area because it protrudes. I don't know if I'm bloated or what, but this workout here is like perfect for that area. It's like not necessarily under your boob and not necessarily the lower belly it's like that stubborn center section around your belly button that always makes you look like you have a kangaroo pouch so if you thought that these helpful tips were pretty good make sure to comment down below like and subscribe to this video